Hello everyone, I'm Melissa here and welcome to your Melissa Moments. Hello everyone, Melissa here. Welcome to your Melissa Moment and welcome to Scentsy Saturday. You guys, we are in April now, which means I would like to share with you the bars that I warmed through in March. Okay. I thought there'd be more, um, but there's not. So where I live, March is still winter. So I kind of started it off with spiced eggnog, uh, a whole bar of spiced eggnog. I really like this one. It's, it smells really good. I find it a bit on the lighter side. Uh, it's in my club. But I don't know if it's going to stay there forever. It is really nice. It's literally a spiced eggnog. I love it around the Christmas time, winter time. So I got through a bar of that. I did not get through a full bar. I got through three cubes of this. This is very snowy spruce. This is my favorite tree scent that Scentsy has made so far. Um, I didn't get through a whole bar because... It's starting to become spring where I live, and it just, I was getting over the tree scents. I was getting over it. So I only got through three cubes. Oh, it's my favorite tree scent, though. It's, it's, it's a tree scent. It's spruce, but it's got a sweetness to it, so it's not that harsh. I don't know how else to describe it. It's just, it's a really nice, like smooth tree scent. I'm not sure how to describe it, but I really like it. Very snowy spruce in my club. Okay. This one, gingerbread buttercream. Okay. I got through a full bar. So this one came out, uh, they brought out a buttercream collection. Okay. I wanted to love it. It sounded amazing. All of them are very light. Vanilla bean buttercream, peppermint buttercream, gingerbread buttercream. Um, there was another one. Vanilla, gingerbread, peppermint, and... Or no, candy cane buttercream. Sorry, it was candy cane buttercream, gingerbread buttercream, um, caramel buttercream, and vanilla bean buttercream. I really like this one. So I wanted to warm another bar to decide if it was going to stay in my club or not. It's nice. It just didn't have what I was looking for. So unfortunately, gingerbread buttercream was cut from my club. Um, they had a scent called gingerbread hugs which I think came out two years ago. I love that one. I did not put it in my club. It is no longer available. I'm kind of kicking myself on that. If gingerbread hugs ever comes back, it will be going back in my club because I like that one a lot, but did get through a bar of gingerbread buttercream. Okay. Bring back my bar came out January. I got a few of the scents. I wanted to try them to see if they were going to stay in my club or not. Let's see what I warmed through. Rum Raisin Cookie. Again, I really like the smell. It just didn't hold up for me. I'll be honest, none of the Bring Back My Bars I tried, I liked. Not that I didn't like them, but there was something wrong. Either it was too light or the scent didn't last very long. Um, so, I mean, it, on cold, it's nice. There's nothing wrong with it. It's not offensive. It just wasn't enough for me. Sorry, rum raisin cookie. Fried ice cream. This is another one. It's just same thing. Sorry, didn't make it for me. I got through a bar though, fried ice cream. 
hazelnut latte. Now, out of all the ones I tried, this is the one that I thought if I was going to put one in my club, it was going to be this one. I do really like it. It is really nice. It literally is a hazelnut latte. But it just wasn't unique enough. I have a few other bars in my club that are very similar. So I was like, you know what? I'm sorry, I can't. I did get through a bar, though. Hazelnut latte. Uh, crumb top. This one is nice. I did like the scent, but it just didn't last that long for me. And just to let you know, when I try out a new scent, I use a full bar at a time. Okay? There's eight cubes of wax in a bar. I have eight warmers on my main floor. I put a cube in every warmer because I really want to get a full experience of what the scent is like. So that's the way I try to really decide if I like it or not. And I'm sorry, but Crumb Top just didn't make the cut either. Again, nothing wrong with it. Not offensive. Just didn't quite do it for me. Vanilla Cream, same thing. Really pretty scent. Really liked it. It was vanilla. It was smooth. Yeah, it was nice. <coughs> oh, excuse me, guys. But it, it was very similar to like vanilla bean buttercream. There wasn't anything unique about it. There wasn't anything really different. Vanilla cream. So I let that one go too. Last bring back my bar I tried. Melon and apple granita. This one I was surprised at. I actually really liked this one. This one was close to staying in my club. It's really pretty. I really like it, but again, when it came down to it, I have other scents currently in my club that I just like a lot more. My club is out of control, you guys. It's always out of control. I think it's sitting around $350 every three months. So I'm doing my best when it comes to putting things in my Scentsy Club. They really have to check all my boxes. I, I'm, it's, I've, I've got rules and I have to be really strict on it because otherwise my club is going to be completely out of control. So as much as I like this one, the melon and apple granita, I have other summery scents that I just love more. So it didn't make it. Okay. Lavender cotton. I love, love lavender cotton. I got through a full bar. Typically I do this one in the bedroom, especially my daughter's room. It's just really relaxing. I really like it. It's a great scent. Oh, it's so good. I also have a scent memory with this scent. I used to use the scent in my daughter's room when she was a baby in the nursery because it's very calming. It's very soothing. So every time I smell it, it kind of takes me back to those baby years. She's seven now, but I just, I have positive feelings when I smell this one. So this one will probably be staying in my club forever. If it, if they ever decide to discontinue it, it will be in my club. I really like lavender cotton. It's really, really nice. And the last one, blue agave and melon. I've started my spring and summer scents, you guys, and I feel good about it. I feel really good. This one, it's good. Now here's the thing. I don't remember if this one's available in the catalog, if it came back or not. I didn't put it in my club. I remember this one specifically. I really like it. But I had like three scents in my club that were very similar, including this one. And I did kind of a sniff off between the three to pick one. And I picked a different one. It wasn't this one. But you guys, I warmed this one. It's so good. Oh, it's so good. 
it's just, it's got a sweetness and a fruitiness and if this one's not currently available, if it ever comes back, I might put it back in my club because it's so nice. You know, it's one of those ones where you just walk by your warmer and you just get that little whiff and it just right away, you just feel like happy and like, Ooh, like what's that smell? It's so nice. Yeah. Blue agave and melon it is a good one. You guys, it's good. So I got through a full bar of that. That's all I got through for March, you guys. Uh, and it was a struggle. I don't know why. I don't know if it's because I was expecting more from the bring back my bars and I was kind of disappointed. I always look at March as kind of a transition month between winter and spring. So it's always kind of like, what do you warm? Do you still warm like the wintry scents or do you start in with the spring scents? It's kind of a tricky month for me when it comes to Scentsy. So that's what we got through for March. Now let's talk about April. Okay. We're in April. You're watching this in April. Here's the thing. We're on vacation for three weeks out of April. So I'm not going to have hardly any Scentsy to share with you, um, in May because I'm not home to warm my Scentsy. I'm not taking my Scentsy with me. I know a lot of people who travel do take their warmers with them. I will not be doing that. So there probably will not be a what was Melissa warming April video to see in May. I'm probably going to combine April and May and share with you in June. That's probably what's going to happen. Okay. Now I'm not saying that I'm not going to have any Scentsy videos. I don't know. There might be. It depends if there's a collection or something that comes out. We'll see. Um, I do get my, oh, my Scentsy Club does ship in May. So I will be sharing with you my Scentsy Club uh, haul in May. And there will be some new scents in there that I haven't sniffed yet. So you will get that Scentsy video in May. Um, and that's everything for today. So thank you guys so much for watching. What did Melissa warm in April? I hope you guys enjoyed it. Let me know. Did you try any of the bring back my bar scents that came out in January? Um, was there anything that you loved or that you hated? I love to hear from you guys. Thank you guys so much for your support. We'll see you in the next one. Bye.